welcome back to my channel. I'm so happy you're here. I'm Ella and today I want to talk to you guys about how I've been working towards being more sustainable and using cleaner beauty. So the company that I try is Pharmacy. It's a US brand. I found their moisturizer called Daily Greens. It uses papaya and it smells so good. I'm going to show you guys it in the video. So the ones that I'm going to show you guys is a makeup remover, an eye cream, a serum, of course, my favorite, the uh, Daily Greens Moisturizer. And then also I ordered some face masks and so I'm gonna show you guys all of their great products from Pharmacy. So let's get started. So I'm gonna show you guys how I kind of get ready for bed and remove the products. And then later in the video, I'm gonna go over how I use the face mask before bed. So the first one I wanna show you guys is their makeup removal balm called Green Clean and it's huge. It's like has more than you'd ever need for all of your heavy duty makeup needs. And it actually could be used as a cleanser, it's kind of like two in one. And afterwards when you use it, it leaves your skin feeling really hydrated and silky. So it even kind of has like this moisturizing hydration function into it as well. Like this, so you guys can tell that I've used it quite a lot. And then when you use it, it starts to melt from heat. So first you want to get like a good amount. And then when you start to use it, it'll start to melt. Just put it on dry and just start rubbing it in and it kind of gives yourself a little mini massage and it just feels so good and then just wash it right off like i said it can be used as a facial cleanser so it gets up all the gunk and makeup and like kind of just all the excess dust from the day i don't feel like there's excess gunk after washing my face it gets up everything and it's really gentle on your eyelashes so i definitely recommend you guys giving it a try and i'm gonna go use it right now and then come back and show you guys the moisturizer and the rest of the eye cream and the pack so stay tuned I'm back and I have a clean washed face. So now I'm gonna try on some of the products that I ordered So I have my Pharmacy box here. So the first thing I want to show you guys is the oil free moisturizer from pharmacy and it is with papaya So it smells so good. I was using their honey moisturizer But then now that it's summer and I'm kind of sweating a bit more and I need something a bit more cooling The honey moisturizer was a bit too heavy for summer So I definitely recommend you guys could try that in the winter if you have more drier skin or maybe for dry patches on your skin or even body But definitely for summer I recommend this light one. So I'm gonna give it a try now. It smells so good like like a like a drink or some juice and the color is really beautiful it's really light also it's paraben free so you don't have to worry about uh, toxic chemicals and also it doesn't use like uh, toxic chemicals it's 100 percent vegan it doesn't do animal testing so you guys can just see simply on their packaging that they're clean beauty products for me i just use uh like about a t tablespoon amount uh for my skin just like this much and so i'm gonna and you guys can already see how moisturizing it is it's like really creamy and just really smooth and it already has like a cooling effect so i'm gonna put some on my face i don't know it feels like when you go to the spa and you get a little mini massage it's just so moisturizing and you can already feel your skin is really like absorbing all of the nutrients in the moisturizer it's just so glowing like my skin just feels already it's absorbed it's pretty much you know already in but i can still kind of feel i feel very hydrated like as if i drank water okay so two i have for the eye cream is this cherry up brightening vitamin c and you can see it's really pink i think the color is really cute it's just it's just really simple cheer up like whenever you see this sitting on your counter and you just see a little cute cherry and someone says cheer up i just feel like happiness already so this one is really good i think for winter but i'll show you guys it anyway it's a bit more creamier and thicker than the other moisturizer uh for, i mean the, than the other eye cream i'm going to show you guys so you guys can see it's just very creamy and pretty good for eye cream if you need that so I'm just gonna put it on one of my eyes and then do the other one with the other eye cream that I got so I think maybe actually even if you kind of don't uh, want to use it for winter you want to use it all year round I think maybe this could be like your night eye cream and then the other one I'm gonna show you could be maybe for more day because it's a bit lighter so I already feel like the moisturizer is set in I have my eye cream set in and it feels really moisturizing I feel my skin just like had a drink of water I mean, honestly, I don't think you really need to do a face mask before this or you need extra things, but definitely I'm already feeling like my skin's kind of like just got some life into it and it feels less tired. 
So the other one I got is Do It All. Um, it's a total eye cream. So this one is cherry with brightening vitamin C extract. So this is more for like kind of dealing with dark under eye circles to get a brightening effect. And this one is more with for wrinkles and kind of giving your overall hydration to your eyes. The skin around here is really thin and it gets a lot of sun damage easier. So we want to make sure that you're using a bit of a heavier, more targeting zone cream than your moisturizer. So this one you could actually use for both morning and night. Um, personally, I like to do the um, cherry up the cheer up cherry up <laughs> the cheer up eye cream for uh night just because it's a bit heavier and then using the do it all for mornings so it also has like this kind of green tone color so you can already kind of tell it's a lot lighter it's a lot creamier and smoother than the cherry up eye cream it's a little bit more hydrating than a thick clay especially when you're doing your makeup sometimes that can get a bit heavy when you're using a lot of products especially with your concealer and your foundation and then your primer so you want to kind of go for something lighter for the mornings and then just kind of rub it all in definitely this side feels a bit heavier and this side it feels a bit lighter i think it's good to have both just so you have a variety and you can kind of alternate between some days maybe when you had a bit too much to drink or you stayed up too late you can kind of go for a heavier one with the cherry one and then if you're feeling like, you know, you need a little bit of a lift or some hydration and just want to go for something light and simple, then definitely the do it up is better for that. Okay, so then the other things that I got, the samples, was also the Daily Greens um, moisturizer that I just used earlier. So you can get a little cute travel size. So the other thing I forgot to mention about this um, moisturizer is that it's very lightweight, it's very hydrating, and it's silicone free and parable free. Parable? No and paraben free. I always have trouble with the pronunciation of that word. So then I also got the Melt Away makeup remover, a mini travel size. I also got a little mini Daily Greens moisturizer and it's super cute. Okay. And I like that they have simple packaging, which you can tell is good for the environment. And there you go. It's just super cute. It's actually almost the same size as the eye cream, the Cherry Up. Oh yeah, they're the exact same. They're glass, so you know that they're good for the environment, reducing plastic. I got the Honeymoon Glow. I think the names are so cute. Cherry Up, Do It All, Daily Greens, Honeymoon Glow, which is so cute. And it's a resurfacing night serum, so I'm going to give this just a try before I go to bed when I show you guys. Hydrating Coconut Mask, and it's a gel mask, so it just, when you put it on, especially in summer, it has a, such a good cooling effect, so I like to keep these in the fridge. Just before I go to bed, I have a nice cool gel mask. It's really soothing, it's really hydrating, it has coconut oil and cucumber, so you know that you're getting a very um, refreshing um, little mini spa before bed and actually when I use it before bed I actually fall asleep faster just because I kind of feel secure I know that my skin is getting a good like health vitamin <laughs> I guess that's a good way to explain it with the hyaluric acid you know that your skin is getting more healthy and it's gonna prevent acne and prevent wrinkles and kind of just update your skin's health so I like to use this one on days where I'm kind of dehydrated, I've had a long day at the office, I'm feeling a little bit tired. This is definitely the hydrating one you should definitely check out. The brightening one is using purple broccoli, but apparently it's really good for kind of brightening your skin. And it also is using coconut gel, so this one is really cooling and has a good gel effect before you go to bed or I mean you can honestly put this before you do your makeup just so that you kind of get a more of a glow effect. It also has plant-based collagen, so it's vegan and it's cruelty free like all the products I showed you from pharmacy and I'm going to show you guys how to use it before I go to bed so let's check it out okay hey you guys I just took a shower I'm all ready for bed after a long week so today I'm going to go with the hydrating mask the coconut gel one you separate it and then you put it on for 20 minutes so I'm going to show you guys the process and then I'm going to show you guys after what it looks like and then after I'm going to use the honeymoon glow serum which is supposed to make your skin kind of brighter and look a little more healthy so we're going to give this one a try I haven't used this one yet so I'm excited to give it a try and it says that you need to use it um two to three times a week to kind of see an effect okay so I have my cute headband ready to go I'm gonna open it and at first it's like this it has a little blue cover around it so first you got to remove the blue uh, paper from the gel mask so I'm gonna remove it one layer gone it says that you can apply either side of the mask to your face you don't have to worry like which side is for the face Take the last part off and there it is the beautiful coconut gel hydration mask it smells really coconutty like coconut water okay so i look extremely scary i won't show you guys any more of this or torture you guys with this so i'm gonna lie with this on for 20 minutes 
and then after I come back and try on the honeymoon glow serum and see how glowing my skin becomes and it's oh I already feel like working the hydration so I'll be right back Hey guys, I'm back. Okay, I did the mask for 20 minutes and I already feel my skin extremely well hydrated. After you do it, you want to rub in the um, all the excess um, cream. And now I'm going to try the Honeymoon Glow. Oh, look at that. I thought I had to like rip this open, but if I just go like that, quick and simple. So this Honeymoon Glow is an AHA resurfacing serum. So it's for night before you go to bed. And then you're supposed to use it like two to three times a week so that you see more effective results. So you guys can see there's like a line here. So all I have to do is just go like this, right? Yeah, there we go. Okay, got it. Look at that, that's quite that's quite easy to use. I thought I had to like rip this off like you do for like jelly containers. Okay, so I'm not gonna put a lot on just cause I wanna try to use this for three times a week. Oh wow, that is really soft and smooth. Wow, I don't even need that much. Like you guys can see, I'm just putting a little, little bit and it's like a teardrop and it's just enough to cover my whole face and then pat it all in and now i'm ready for my beauty sleep okay guys thanks for watching my video i really enjoyed showing you guys my work towards more clean beauty products and please let me know if you guys have used pharmacy products or if you guys are gonna try it and some questions you have definitely leave a comment and let me know um maybe some other clean beauty products that you guys are using that you'd recommend and i'll give it a try and so good luck to you guys and keeping your skin very healthy and hydrated in this hot summer and i'll see you guys in the next video thanks bye